friends, welcome to my YouTube channel, myself Mudu. So my YouTube channel is Science Match Academy 2023. In this YouTube channel, you will get everything about class 10th math science. So tricky methods, old question papers will be solved, new question papers, new model papers will be solved. So everything will be get in only one channel. So please like my videos, share my videos and please don't forget to subscribe my channel and please press the bell icon. Any doubt is there, please comment in the comment box. Thank you. In this video, we are going to answer for key answers mathematics of class 10th SSLC board 2023. So this examination has been conducted on 3-4-2023. Now let us answer the first question. The number of zeros of the polynomial y is equal to p of x in the given graph is. So let us see how many zeros are there. So here 1, 2, 3 zeros are there. So now the right option for this question is that is answer is 3. So option is A. So A has 3 and the other. So for the first question, the option is A that is 3 is the answer. Now let us move for the question number 2. So question number 2 is for an event E, if P of E is equal to 0 0.75 and then P of E bar is dash and the so P of E कोटी दने नमगे P of E bar केड़ी दने इली 0.75 इदे एन मेले नाव let us find out P of E bar so P of E bar is equal to 1 minus P of E so P of E bar is equal to 1 minus P of E is 0.75 therefore P of E bar is equal to 1 minus 0.75 is 0 0.25 अगर 0.25 वेली देन तो नोड़ आप्शन ना so 0.25 option B so for this question option B is the right answer option B 0.25 now let us move for the question number third so question number three ये नी देन तो नोड़ ना so question number three नली इगे कोटी है the total surface area the total surface area of a right circular cylinder Having radius r and height h is dash and the koti So total surface area keli rodrinda. The right answer is option D 2 pi r into r plus h. So for the third question, option D 2 pi r into r plus h. Now let us move for question number 4. So question number 4 in the antanana. So the number that represent the reminder when 19 is equal to 6 into 3 plus 1 is compared with Euclid's division lemma A is equal to BQ plus R. This is reminder is to the So kotti radna first now barkoana. So what is they have given? 19 is equal to 6 into 3 plus 1. A is equal to 19 is A. 6 is B. 3 is Q. And R is 1. So A is equal to BQ plus R. A and 19 B and 6 Q and 3. Reminder is 1. Therefore, reminder is 1. Agar a reminder 1 nanta tokondaga. So option C is the right answer. So for fourth question, option C reminder is equal to 1. Now let us move for question number 5. So question number 5 any then the norna in the figure. So in the give, uh, given figure, PB is a tangent, PB tangent to at the point A to the circle with center O, if angle AOP could be there, A, AOP, E angle of 45 degree in the could be there, either in an angle, either radius of the tangent of the 90 degree in the angle between tangent and radius, so either 90, either 45 in the middle, either 45 in the middle. Because 90 plus 45, 135, 135 plus 45 is 180. So, so now we, we want the angle OPA. So for fifth question, angle OPA is equal to 180 minus 90 plus 45. Angle OPA is equal to 180 minus 90 plus 45 is 135. Angle OPA is equal to 180 minus 135 is 
45 degree so option a is the answer now let us move for question number 6 so question number 6 ke hogana so question number 6 yen ide anta nodana in the figure in the figure if de parallel to bc then the correct relation among the following is idrolige correct relation yavudu anta kelidare so nalak option nu nodana yavudu correct agide anta ad by ab is equal to id agodilla ad by ad by db is equal to a uh, ec by ec ec by ae anta kottare idu agodilla murne dikke barana ad by db ad by db is equal to ae by ec so option c after so for uh, sixth question the right option is option c that is ad by db is equal to ae by ec that is third theorem so now let us move for question number 7 so question number 7 in ide anta nodana so the line representing by the equation 4x plus 5y minus 10 is equal to 0 and 8x plus 10y plus 20 is equal to 0 or ee nalakralli yav line unta nodana so illi list maadkonana first so list maadkonodadre a1 is equal to 4 a2 is equal to 8 then b1 is equal to b1 is ide 5 and what is b2 10 then c1 is equal to c1 plus ali minus 10 ide and c2 plus ali 20 ide so agadre a1 by a2 is equal to b1 by b2 because 4 by 8 is equal to 5 by 10 4 ones are 4 twos are 5 ones are 5 twos are both are equal to 1 by 2 so but c1 by c2 madkondre c1 by c2 is equal to minus 10 by 20 which is equal to minus 1 by 2 so adrinda so illi a1 by a2 is equal to b1 by b2 but not equal to c1 by c2 so adrinda so illi a1 by a2 is equal to b1 by b2 but not equal to c1 by c2 andre those two lines are parallel lines so veradu kuda parallel lines agirutte so parallel lines andre option d is the answer so option d parallel lines now let us move for question number 8 so question number 8 ge hogana so question number 8 igide that is the distance of the point minus 8 comma 3 from the x axis so x axis andre you have to take the value of y so y value is to the 3 is the, so the right answer is option b 3 units so for 8th question option b 3 units is the right answer now let us move for the next question express the denominator of 7 by 80 ninth question 7 by 80 na we have to express the denominator e formal express madbek now so it can be expressed as 7 by uh, 80, 80 na ek barena 16 into 5 7 divided by 16 can be written as 2 to the power of 4 into 5 can be written as 5 to the power of 1 agadre 2 to the power of n into 5 to the power of m andre 2 to the power of 4 into 5 to the power of 1 so now let us move for question number 10 so question number 10 if the pair of lines represented by the linear equation x plus 2y minus 4 is equal to 0 and ax plus by minus 12 is equal to 0 or coincident line so we have to find the value of a and b so let us find out the value of a and b a and b is so x plus 2y is equal x plus 2y minus 4 is equal to 0 Yerne equation no? ax plus by minus 12 is equal to 0. So a1 is equal to a1 and 1, then a2 and a, b1 and 2, b2 and b, c1 and minus 4, c2 and minus 12. So, this is the answer. 
ಇಲ್ಲಿ ನೋಡಿ ಇದನ್ನು ಈಸಿಯಾಗಿ ನಾವು ಆನ್ಸರ್ ಮಾಡೋದಾದರೆ ಈಗೂ ಕೂಡ ಮಾಡ್ಬೋದು ಈ ಫಸ್ಟು ನಾನು ಸಿ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಸಿ ಟು ಮಾಡ್ಕೊತೀನಿ ಸೊ ಸಿ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಸಿ ಟು ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಮೈನಸ್ ಫೋರ್ ಬೈ ಮೈನಸ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ ಇದೆ ಮೈನಸ್ ಮೈನಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ಸಲ್ ಆಯಿತು ಒನ್ ಬೈ ತ್ರೀ ಬಂತು ಅವನು ಕೋಇನ್ಸಿಡೆಂಟ್ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿದ ಮೇಲೆ ಎ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಎ ಟು ಶುಡ್ ಬಿ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಬಿ ಟು ಶುಡ್ ಬಿ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಸಿ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಸಿ ಟು ಹಾಗಾದರೆ ನಾವು ಇವಾಗ ಎ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಎ ಟು ಮಾಡಿದ್ರೂ ಕೂಡ ನಮಗೆ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಗೆಟ್ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ತ್ರೀ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ತ್ರೀ ಬರಬೇಕು ಅಂದರೆ ಎ ಒನ್ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಗೊತ್ತು ಒನ್ ಅಂತ ಇನ್ನು ಎ ಟು ಅಂದರೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ತ್ರೀ ಇರಬೇಕು ಅಂದರೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಒನ್ ಇದೆ ಅಂದಮೇಲೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ತ್ರೀ ಬರಬೇಕು ಅಂದರೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ತ್ರೀ ಬರಿಬೇಕು ನೀವು ಹಾಗಾದರೆ ಎ ಟು ಎ ಟು ಅಂದರೆ ಏನಿದೆ ನೋಡಿ ಎ ದೇರ್ ಫಾರ್ ದ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಆಫ್ ಎ ಈಸ್ ತ್ರೀ ಎ ಅಂದರೆ ತ್ರೀ ಬಂತು ಈಗ ನಾನು ಬಿ ಫೈಂಡ್ ಔಟ್ ಮಾಡ್ತೀನಿ ಬಿ ಫೈಂಡ್ ಔಟ್ ಮಾಡೋದಕ್ಕೆ ಬಿ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಬಿ ಟು ಈಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಸಿ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಸಿ ಟು ಹಾಗಾದರೆ ಬಿ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಬಿ ಟು ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಸಿ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಸಿ ಟು ಅಂದರೆ ಸೊ ಬಿ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಬಿ ಟು ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಸಿ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಸಿ ಟು ಎಷ್ಟು ಬಂದಿದೆ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ತ್ರೀ ಸೊ ಇಲ್ಲೂ ಕೂಡ ನಮಗೆ ಬಿ ಒನ್ ಗೊತ್ತಿದೆ ನಮಗೆ ಸಿ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಆಫ್ ಬಿ ಒನ್ ಟು ಅಂತ ಗೊತ್ತಿದೆ ಸೊ ಹಾಗಾದ್ರೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯೂಷನ್ ಮಾಡಿಕೊಂಡ್ರೆ ಸೊ ಟೂ ಬೈ ಇಲ್ಲೇನು ಅಂತ ಗೊತ್ತಿಲ್ಲ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಒನ್ ಬೈ ತ್ರೀ ಸೊ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಒನ್ ಬರಬೇಕು ಅಂದರೆ ಟೂ ಒನ್ಸ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಳ್ಳಿ ಟೂ ಒನ್ಸ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ತ್ರೀ ಬರಬೇಕು ಅಂದರೆ ನಾನು ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಬರೀಲೇಬೇಕು ಹಾಗಾದರೆ ಟೂ ಒನ್ಸ ಟೂ ತ್ರೀ ಇಸ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ತ್ರೀ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ತ್ರೀ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಒನ್ ಬೈ ತ್ರೀ ಹಾಗಾದರೆ ಬಿ ಟು ನೋಡಿ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವ್ ಮಾಡಿ ಬಿ ಟು ಅಂದರೆ ಏನಿದೆ ಬಿ ಇದೆ ಹಾಗಾದ್ರೆ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಬಿ ಟು ಸೊ ಬಿ ಟು ಅಂದರೆ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ನಾವು ನೋಡೋದಾದರೆ ಸಾರಿ ಬಿ ಟು ಅಲ್ಲ ಬಿ ಸೊ ಬಿ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಎ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಬಿ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಈ ಥರ ನಾವು ಸಾಲ್ವ್ ಮಾಡ್ಕೋಬೇಕು ನಾವು ಲೆಟ್ ಎಸ್ ಮೂವ್ ಫಾರ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಲೆವೆನ್ ಸೊ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಲೆವೆನ್ ಏನಿದೆ ಟ್ರಯಾಂಗಲ್ ಎ ಬಿ ಸಿ ಸಿಮಿಲರ್ ಟು ಟ್ರಯಾಂಗಲ್ ಪಿ ಕ್ಯೂ ಆರ್ ಎ ಬಿ ಸಿ ಟ್ರಯಾಂಗಲು ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಇದೆ ಅದೇ ಪಿ ಕ್ಯೂ ಆರ್ ಟ್ರಯಾಂಗಲು ಹಂಡ್ರೆಡ್ ಸೆಂಟಿಮೀಟರ್ ಸ್ಕ್ವೇರ್ ಇದೆ ಟ್ರಯಾಂಗಲ್ ಎ ಬಿ ಸಿದು ಎ ಬಿ ಏಟ್ ಸೆಂಟಿಮೀಟರ್ ಆದರೆ ಫೈಂಡ್ ದ ಲೆಂತ್ ಆಫ್ ಪಿ ಕ್ಯೂ ಅಂತ ಕೇಳಿದ್ದಾರೆ ನಾವು ಲೆಟ್ ಎಸ್ ರೈಟ್ ಒನ್ ಒನ್ ಟ್ರಯಾಂಗಲ್ ಬರ್ಕೋಣ ನಾವು ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಎ ಬಿ ಸಿ ಸೊ ಒನ್ ಮೋರ್ ಟ್ರಯಾಂಗಲ್ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ರೈಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಯರ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಪಿ ಕ್ಯೂ ಆರ್ ಸೊ ಇದು ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಇದೆ ಇದು ಹಂಡ್ರೆಡ್ ಇದೆ ಸೊ ಅವನು ಎ ಬಿ ಕೊಟ್ಟಿಯೇ ಎ ಬಿ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಏಟ್ ಸೆಂಟಿಮೀಟರ್ ಅಂತ ಕೊಟ್ಟಿಯೇ ನಮಗೆ ಬೇಕಾಗಿರೋದು ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಪಿ ಕ್ಯೂ ಸೊ ಎ ಬಿಗೆ ಕರೆಸ್ಪಾಂಡಿಂಗು ಪಿ ಕ್ಯೂ ಇದೆ ನಾವು ಲೆಟ್ ಎಸ್ ಫೈಂಡ್ ಔಟ್ ದ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಆಫ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಪಿ ಕ್ಯೂ ಪಿ ಕ್ಯೂ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂನ ನಾವೀಗ ಫೈಂಡ್ ಔಟ್ ಮಾಡೋಣ ಸೊ ಲೆಟ್ ಎಸ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಸೊ ಲೆಟ್ ಎಸ್ ಯೂಸ್ ದ ಏರಿಯಾಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಸಿಮಿಲರ್ ಟ್ರಯಾಂಗಲ್ ಸೊ ಸಿಮಿಲರ್ ಟ್ರಯಾಂಗಲ್ ಏರಿಯಾನ ಯೂಸ್ ಮಾಡಿಕೊಂಡ್ರೆ ಅದನ್ನು ನಾವು ಈಗ ಬರೆಯೋಣ ಏರಿಯಾ ಆಫ್ ಟ್ರಯಾಂಗಲ್ ಎ ಬಿ ಸಿ ಡಿವೈಡೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಏರಿಯಾ ಆಫ್ ಟ್ರಯಾಂಗಲ್ ಪಿ ಕ್ಯೂ ಆರ್ ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಸೊ ಎ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಎ ಬಿ ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ಎ ಬಿಗೆ ಕರೆಸ್ಪಾಂಡಿಂಗು ಪಿ ಕ್ಯೂ ಪಿ ಕ್ಯೂ ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ಎ ಬಿ ಸಿ ಅಂದರೆ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ಟಿ ಫೋರು ಪಿ ಕ್ಯೂ ಆರ್ ಅಂದರೆ ಹಂಡ್ರೆಡ್ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಎ ಬಿ ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ಅಂದರೆ ಏಟ್ ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ಡಿವೈಡೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಪ
2x square minus 4x plus 3 is equal to 0. So what is the standard form? ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0. a is equal to 2. b is equal to minus 4. c is equal to 3. So delta is equal to b square minus 4ac. Delta is equal to minus 4 whole square minus 4 into a and 2 c and 3. So delta is equal to minus 4 whole square is 16 minus 4 twos are 8, 8 threes are 24. So delta is equal to minus 8. Therefore the discriminant of the quadratic equation delta is equal to minus 8. Now let us move for question number 14. Find the coordinates of the midpoints of the line, jo line segment joining the points 6, 3 and 4, 7. So now let us answer this question. So 6, 3 and 4, 7. So you call this as x1, y1 and you call this as x2, y2. So now let us use the midpoint. So p x, y is equal to x1 plus x2 by 2 comma y1 plus y2 divided by 2 so that is equal to so x1 is to the node so x1 and 6 plus x2 and 4 by 2 comma y1 and 3 plus y2 and 7 divided by 2 so that is equal to 6 plus 4 is 10 10 by 2 comma 3 plus 7 is 10 divided by 2 so agadre so idu that is equal to 2 1s are 2 5s 2 1s are 2 5s therefore the coordinates of the point is 5 comma 5 so 5 comma 5 is the answer now let us move for question number that is 15 so let us see what is the question number 15 so write the degree of the polynomial anta kelidane so let us answer this one. So what is the degree of the polynomial? The degree of the polynomial is is to degree nodi 4 a. So for 15th question, for 15th, the right answer is, so degree is equal to 4. Now let us move for 16th question. Write the formula to find the volume of frustum of a cone in the given figure. So now let us write the volume of frustum of a cone. So V is equal to 1 by 3 pi H into R1 square plus R1 square plus R2 square plus R1 R2. So this is the formula to calculate the first term of a cone. So by this we have completed one marks question. Now let us move for the two marks question that is from question number 17 to question number 24. So question number uh, uh, 17 no, show that 5 plus root 3 5 plus root 3 is an irrational number on the so let us uh, show it so let us assume that let us assume that let us assume that 5 plus root 3 5 plus root 3 is rational so 5 plus root 3 is equal to p by q where p and q where p and q are co prime so p mate q they are co prime so now let us move for the next step so mundin step kiyogana so mundin step nali 5 plus root 3 is equal to p by q so root 3 is equal to p by q plus 5 we could have under minus 5 root 3 is equal to q na lcm te contra p minus 5 into q is 5q so ega p minus 5q divided by q is rational if this is rational if it is equal to root 3 Therefore, root 3 is also rational. Root 3 is also rational. But, this contradicts that, contradicts that our assumption is wrong. 
contradicts that our assumption is wrong root 3 is not rational root 3 is not rational if it is not rational then 5 plus root 3 is irrational so like this we have to prove it so ade 17th question alli innond internal choice question ide let us answer that internal choice question find the hcf of 72 and 120 by using euclid's division algorithm anta ide so now let us find out it so 72 And one twenty seventy two ones are seventy two ten minus two is eight then eleven minus seven is four so इधर ना ये क्या बोल रहे हैं ना one twenty is equal to seventy two into one plus forty eight next तो यार next टॉपिक बोल रहे हैं ना so forty eight and seventy two forty eight ones are forty eight so now twelve minus eight is four then six minus four is two So seventy two can be written as forty eight into one plus twenty four. So now let us move for the next step. Next step, now le we have to take twenty four and forty eight. So twenty four matte forty eight na thoka na next step now le. Let us take twenty four and forty eight. So twenty four and forty eight. Twenty four twos are forty eight. So remainder is zero. Remain to zero at baratan ka marbe ko. This can be written as forty-eight is equal to twenty-four into two plus zero. So remainder zero banda ka. What will be the divisor? That is the HCF. So HCF is equal to twenty-four. So twenty-four is the HCF. Now let us move for question number eighteen. So question number eighteen. Any then can we? Solve the given pair of linear equation three x plus y is equal to twelve. So they have given three x plus y is equal to twelve. One more x plus y is equal to six. You call this as one and this as two. Iga equation one minus equation two marna. So three x plus y is equal to twelve and x plus y is equal to six. Now plus become minus plus become minus plus become minus. Plus y minus y cancel आये तो three x l one x ओढ़े two x ओ twelve l six ओढ़े six so x is equal to six by two two ones are two threes the value of x is three so x बन में ले y find out मरे so x plus y is equal to six y is equal to six minus x y is equal to six minus three y is equal to three So the value of x is three and y is also three. So like this, we have to answer question number eighteen. Now let us move for question number nineteen. So nineteen question you need to find the twentieth term of the AP four comma seven comma ten comma ten comma dash dash by using formula. So now they have given the first term a is equal to four. So difference is. Seven minus four that is equal to three. N is equal to twenty. Now we have to find out a twenty is equal to question mark. So a n is equal to a plus n minus one into d. A twenty is equal to a under four plus n under twenty minus one into d under three. A twenty is equal to four plus nineteen into three. A twenty is equal to four plus nineteen threes are fifty seven. So A twenty is equal to so fifty seven plus four, which is equal to sixty one. This is the answer for question number nineteen. Uh, Now let us move for question number twenty. So question number twenty, any then to know or not? So in the question number twenty, so the question is find the roots of the equation. Two uh, x square minus five x plus three by using quadratic formula. And that is so two x square minus five x plus three is equal to zero by using quadratic formula. So let us write the standard form. So let us write the standard form. A x square plus b x plus c is equal to zero. 
a is equal to 2 b is equal to minus 5 c is equal to 3 x is equal to minus b minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac divided by 2a so x is equal to minus of minus 5 plus or minus square root of 5, minus 5 whole square minus 4 into a and the c uh, sorry a and the 2 c and the 3 divided by 2 into a and the 2 so x is equal to minus into minus four plus 5 plus r minus square root of 25 minus 4 2 is 8 8 3 is 24 divided by 2 2 is 4 x is equal to 5 plus r minus square root of 1 divided by 4 so x is equal to 5 plus r minus square root of 1 is 1 divided by 4 x is equal to 5 plus 1 by 4 or x is equal to 5 minus 1 by 4 so x is equal to 6 by 4 and x is equal to 4 by 4 3 2 3s are 2 2s are 4 1s are 4 1s are therefore x is equal to either 3 by 2 or x is equal to 1 so like this we have to find the value of x idrolagade innond internal choice question ide a internal choice question nu kuda nam maalna find the roots of the equation 5x square minus 6x minus 2 is equal to 0 by the method of completing square. So now let us answer this one. equation 5x square minus 6x minus 2 is equal to 0. So first name So complete. So now first step na learn maalna. X square ke coefficient 5 So everything each term should be divided by 5. Divide each term by 5. Prati term no 5 in the divide madi. So 5x square by 5 minus 6 by 5x minus 2 by 5 which is equal to 0. Agar uldi deno x square 5 5 cancel it x square minus 6 by 5x is equal to e minus 2 by 5 we could occur say it will become plus 2 by 5 either. Ega, e, uh, of 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 coefficient of x whole square what is the coefficient of x minus 6 by 5 whole square 2 1s are 2 3s are that is equal to minus 3 by 5 whole square so minus 3 by 5 whole square will become 3 3 is a 9 5 5 is a 25. Hagadre both uh, both that is uh, LHS and RH, RHS should be added by 9 by 25. So LHS mathe RHS na yerudunu koda we have to divide it by 9 uh, sorry we have to add it by 9 by 25. So I don't know add mark on any there. So x square minus 6 by 5x plus 9 by 25 is equal to 2 by 5 plus 9 by 25. So, here it is add more corner. So, either now this can be written as x minus 3 by 5 whole square is equal to how much it will become 2 plus uh, 9 is 11 divided by oh sorry we have to take the LCM sorry. LCM take over 5 go 25 go LCM take on right 25 I in uh, 5 1s are 25 so 5 is 2 5 is 10 plus uh, 25 25 cancel other 9 so x minus 3 by 5 whole square is equal to it will become uh, 10 plus 9 19 divided by 25 so 19 divided by 25 so you got a square degree you got a root x minus 3 by 5 is equal to plus or minus square root of 19 divided by 25. So x minus 3 by 5 is equal to plus or minus square root of 19 divided by 5. So x is equal to either na you could shift mark corner x is equal to 3 by 5 plus or minus square root of 19 by 5. Square root of 19 by 5. 
19 by 5. So x is equal to 3 plus or minus square root of 19 divided by 5. So this is the root. So what is the root? x is equal to 3 plus or minus square root of 19 divided by 5. So now let us move for question number 21. So in the in the figure, if angle ABC 90 degree, then find the value of sin theta and cos alpha. So sin theta and cos alpha the value find out. So now let us answer this question. So modulo nano sin theta na find out mark continue. I cos alpha na find out marana. So 21 question. So first to on the right angle triangle number parna. This is 90 degree, this is theta. So, yaw the triangle ado A, B, C. So, values per point 1, idu 2, idu root 3. First, to sin theta bek nangge. Sin theta is equal to, idu theta andre, idu opposite to idu hypotenuse. Agar opposite andre 1 idu, hypotenuse andre 2 idu. Next, to namik beka yaradu cos alpha beko. So, now let us find out the value of cos alpha. Idu, idu alpha ili. 1, 2 and root 3. So cos alpha is equal to so idu alpha andre idu opposite to idu adjacent to idu hypotenuse. Agar adjacent by hypotenuse andre 1 by 2. So cos alpha is also equal to 1 by 2. So like this we have to find out the value of sin theta and cos alpha. Now let us move for question number 22. So question number 22. So they have given a box containing uh, a box contains cards which are numbered from 9 to 19. If one card is drawn at random from the box, find the probability that it bears a prime number. So now let us answer this question. So first to n of s is equal to 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. If total of n of s is equal to 11. Next to n of a bar kona. Idro lagi prime number kedi dara. Yaave prime number anta norna. The prime numbers are 11 is a prime number, 13 is a prime number, 17 is a prime number, and 19 is a prime number. Total if prime number 4 ida. So p of a is equal to n of a divided by n of s. So n of a divided by n of s. So n of a 4. N of s 11. No. So the answer is the probability is 4 divided by 11. So like this we have to answer the question number 22. Now let us move for question number 23. So question number 23. In the figure ABCD is a trapezium in which AB parallel DC. BC perpendicular to DC. And if AB is equal to 6 cm, CD is equal to 10 cm, AD is equal to 5 cm. Now we have to find out what is the distance between the parallel lines. So AB and CD are parallel lines. So you can find the distance. And the distance is the distance. This distance is the distance. Na find out parallel lines are the distance. distance na. So now let us answer question number 23. So first to the figure number one. So it is a trapezium. So this is a trapezium. It is 90 degree there. So A, it is B, it is C and this is D. So they have given, they have given, it is 6, A, B, 6 and the D, C, 10 centimeter and the Now we distance between B and C or distance between E distance. So, I will draw a dotted line. So, it is a perpendicular line. Okay. So, we will solve this. We will observe this. This is the point of E. So, from A to B, 6 is the same. From C to, uh, sorry, E to C, this is 6. E distance is 6. This is 6. This is 6. This is 4 cm. DV, DE will be 4 cm. Okay. This is the next one. Uh, the unknown distance is the same. AD is the same. E distance is the same. A is the same. This is 5 cm. 
ಹಾಗಾದರೆ ನಾವೀಗ ಈ ಟ್ರಯಾಂಗಲ್ ತೊಗೊಳ್ಳೋಣ ನಮ್ಗೆ ಈಸಿಯಾಗಿ ನೋಡಿ ಇದು ಫೋರ್ ಇದೆ ಇದು ಫೈವ್ ಇದೆ ಅಂದರೆ ಇದು ಈಸಿಯಾಗಿ ಗೊತ್ತಾಗ್ಬಿಡುತ್ತೆ ಈಗ ಸೊ ಲೆಟ್ ಅಸ್ ಫೈಂಡ್ ಔಟ್ ದ ಡಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಎ ಇ ಸೊ ಇನ್ ಟ್ರಯಾಂಗಲ್ ಎ ಡಿ ಇ ಆ್ಯಂಗಲ್ ಎ ಸಾರಿ ಆ್ಯಂಗಲ್ ಇ ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ನೈಂಟಿ ಡಿಗ್ರಿ ಸೊ ಪೈತಾಗರಸ್ನ ಅಪ್ಲೈ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಳ್ಳಿ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಅಪ್ಲೈ ಪೈತಾಗರಸ್ ತೀರ ಎ ಡಿ ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಎ ಇ ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಡಿ ಇ ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಎ ಡಿ ಫೈ ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಎ ಇ ವಿ ಡೋಂಟ್ ನೋ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಡಿ ಇ ಫೋರ್ ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ಸೊ ಫೈ ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ಅಂದರೆ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಫೈವು ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಎ ಇ ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಫೋರ್ ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ಅಂದರೆ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ಟೀನ್ ಸೊ ಎ ಇ ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಮೈನಸ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ಟೀನ್ ಸೊ ಎ ಇ ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ನೈನ್ ಸೊ ಎ ಇ ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ರೂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ನೈನ್ ಸೊ ಎ ಇ ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಸ್ಕ್ವಯರ್ ರೂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ನೈನ್ ಈಸ್ ತ್ರೀ ಸೆಂಟಿಮೀಟರ್ ಸೊ ಹಾಗಾದರೆ ನಾವಿಗೆ ಬರೋಣ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ದ ಡಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ದ ಡಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ಟೂ ಪ್ಯಾರಲ ಲೈನ್ಸ್ ದ ಡಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ಟೂ ಪ್ಯಾರಲ ಲೈನ್ಸ್ ಈಸ್ ತ್ರೀ ಸೆಂಟಿಮೀಟರ್ ಸೊ ಲೈಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಫೈಂಡ್ ಔಟ್ ದ ಡಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಇದಾದಮೇಲೆ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಇದೆ ಸೊ ಅದೇನಪ್ಪ ಅಂದರೆ ಡ್ರಾ ಎ ಸರ್ಕಲ್ ಆಫ್ ರೇಡಿಯಸ್ ಫೋರ್ ಸೆಂಟಿಮೀಟರ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಕನ್ಸ್ಟ್ರಕ್ಟ್ ಎ ಪೇರ್ ಆಫ್ ಟ್ಯಾಂಜನ್ ಟು ಎ ಸರ್ಕಲ್ ಸಚ್ ದಟ್ ದ ಆ್ಯಂಗಲ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ದೆಮ್ ಈಸ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ಟಿ ಡಿಗ್ರಿ ಅಂತ ಕೊಟ್ಟಿಯೇ ಪೇರ್ ಆಫ್ ಟ್ಯಾಂಜನ್ ಟು ದ ಸರ್ಕಲ್ ಆ್ಯಂಗಲ್ ಟ್ಯಾಂಜೆಂಟ್ಗಳ ನಡುವೆ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ಟಿ ಡಿಗ್ರಿ ಅಂತ ಕೊಟ್ಟಿಯೇ ಅಂದರೆ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಕನ್ಸ್ಟ್ರಕ್ಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಒನ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಡಿಗ್ರಿಗೆ ರೇಡಿಯಸ್ನ ನಡುವೆ ಒನ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಡಿಗ್ರಿ ಹಾಕ್ಕೊಂಡು ಇದನ್ನು ನಾವು ಸಾಲ್ವ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ದಟ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಸಾಲ್ವ್ ಇಯರ್ ಸೊ ಈ ವಿಡಿಯೋದಲ್ಲಿ ನಾವು ಒನ್ ಟು ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ಸನ್ನು ನೋಡೋದು ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ಡ್ ಫಾರ್ ಆಲ್ ದ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ವಿಡಿಯೋ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಆನ್ಸ್ ವಿಲ್ ಗೋ ವಿಲ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಆನ್ಸರ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಟು ತರ್ಟಿ ಏಯ್ಟ್ ಸೊ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಯು ಫಾರ್ ವಾಚಿಂಗ್ ಮೈ ಯೂಟ್ಯೂಬ್ ಚಾನಲ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಒನ್ ಹೂ ಈಸ್ ಸಪೋರ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಮೀ ಆ್ಯ